an unboxing video of May's Cocoa Daisy. Um, looks like we're going to have a lot of changes for the June Cocoa Daisy. Um, so we'll see how that all goes. But for May, this is fairly like the past. Um, again, just white paper this time. I'm really excited for this theme, though, because we're getting back to a lot of florals. Um, and... Uh, it's It's been a bit over here. I'm not going to talk about it, but you'll notice in my voice that some stuff's going on. So I'm just going to try and kind of get through this unboxing video so I can play with some of this stuff and go from there. But I appreciate y'all coming to watch and hang out. Um, we got a cute washi, just a little bit of a pattern. Very nice stamps. Um, some of the very nice, I like the floral, like loopy line art floral, which is cute. Die cuts, some vellum circles. I've done those in the past a couple times. Those are fun. Beautiful color on the dots. Uh, the color scheme of this month is pretty. Uh, very nice um, puffy alphas. It's kind of a, is it a gray? Yeah, it seems like a, a light a light gray. Uh, curious, no backer to that one this time, so that's interesting. Um, got some big tags. I think last month, April, either I didn't pay attention and um, I was missing my tags, or we didn't get tags in April, um, which is kind of crazy. But uh, we have tags for May, so, um, well, I'll use that. <laughs> Gosh, yeah, beautiful. I really love the, the art of this one. Um, just gorgeous. Circle, chipboards, always a favorite. I love this. I wish this was an, a monthly. I really do. Um, with different patterns and, and a few quotes. That would be, if I was making the choices, every month would get one of those. Uh, our simple dory. So pretty. Um... Yeah, just, I love the softness of this month's theme. That even with some bold, it's still, it's very open and and pretty. Um, and just the, the assortment of greens, like, oh gosh, look at that. Yeah, just a really, really pretty theme for this month. Uh, some papers. Get both sides of things here. So... Some prints, some floral, more prints, an interesting line one. Um, line, line a day if you can use the full sheet, which is interesting. So that's the Traveler's Notebook Kit. Um, they just announced some changes that I'm not excited for. Um, they're combining three kits into one kit. And I don't really know how they're going to do it. Um, I don't know what what things that I've been getting duplicates of that I won't. So is, I, do I, is that okay? Is that not okay? Uh, but it's the Traveler's Notebook, the Memory Keeping um, Kit, and the 12 by 12 Scrapbooking Kit. Uh, I have to review the email and um, I get two of this with those subscriptions. So I have to make some choices on changes uh, for my kit. So um, when I have enough brain power to do it I will get in there and figure that out um, but we've got beautiful cards with all the same um, soft green beautiful floral y'all know how much I loved the um, Lillian's garden theme and this is right right there with it matter of fact I can use Lillian Gar uh, some of the Lillian's garden stuff with this um, but yeah I just I love this this soft floral um, look and so yeah so hopefully we'll get to play with some of this just beautiful more die cuts so more circles so there's one so there's one point out and I don't think sorry to dig through here I'm sure I'm pretty sure the die cuts have always been different I don't feel like I've ever gotten duplicate die cuts um, so they think they're different. So that would, instead of having two packs of different ones, I think we're only going to be getting one, one pack. Um, 
And so, yeah, so I don't, yeah. But then duplicates of stuff like that. Um, stamps. Are we only getting one stamp from here on instead of two? I'm not, uh, again, I need to look, but there's changes. So duplicates of that. So I'm trying to just make note for myself of things that I do get duplicates of. Um, some of the wood chip. These are my favorite. I've used them, but they're not my favorite. Um, the bigger cards usually have fun quotes. Um, the date, the days of the month. Oh, that one's just so cute. Yeah, beautiful. Just really, really pretty. Really nice quotes. Um, I need some, need some good quotes. Um, chipboards. They back back in the day. I mean, not that long, but uh, used to do different patterns for the chipboards. Now they do one pattern for both chipboards. So that is now a duplicate thing. So. Um, not the worst to only get one set of chipboards, one set of dots. Although now my mom's been using the dots like crazy. Um, another alpha. This is just a... Oh, actually, you know what? This is metallic, guys. It's black, but it has a little bit of a gold shimmer to it. That's different. I don't know if you can kind of see. There's just a very slight gold shimmer to that that's kind of cool uh, and then we get one sticker sheet um, always has cute boxes these bigger boxes rub-ons gorgeous rub-ons I wish I could find a sub, sub company that I could just get this type of theme like different color palette but same floral theme and same exact items every month it would be so lovely <laughs> that would be my happy place if anyone out there is ready to, to make a, their own subscription company if you want me to sign up that would be my vote <laughs> uh 100 percent um more papers uh same patterns but still very pretty and so actually hold on i need to put that over that's technically a duplicate though right and so that would go here and then stationary kit I think this one's this one's getting is it getting just renamed I don't remember it saying it was combined but getting it's getting something um dry erase marker okay um cute bow oh, and is this a little dry erase eraser is that what this is nope nope whoa these are it's page flags little vellum page flags decent decently thick i think that's just one oh no nope, it's two um here you go so one so it's kind of a vellum um, that's kind of interesting. That's a new product. Kind of neat. Again, they give you so many of them, so you'll, you'll never run out. I don't think I've ever seen anyone complain about running out of anything. <laughs> um, cute little post-its. These are the sticky ones. Yep. Nice little to-dos for a day. That's cool. Um, more die cuts. Again, different than the other ones, so these should be all different sets. Um, then we've got... Oh, what do we have? We have, ah, I see. Okay, so we've got our acetate, beautiful floral. Our vellum has some kind of glitter to it on that. But then we have a dry erase acetate. It has a, it's a little, little thicker than the other one. Um, but I'm assuming that's what the dry erase marker is going to be for. And that is really pretty um things to do and the design interesting that'll be curious to see what we'll be able to use that for and then sets of stickers the days of the week and just decorations there was a washi days of the week i don't love these ones i'd rather just have pattern washi um ow. our pin some cute decor and then this would be the main planner kit 
lovely so this is the kind right this is the kind of washi i like i like the pattern and i like one that matches that that theme floral theme is great pretty pin and gold never my favorite but cute um another one of the zebra um color pencil pens not something i'll use die cuts with the tabs um what is this thing? okay Assuming it's a yeah. Oh, he's hmm. It's a bookmark page. Oh gosh, he's got very strong magnets. So it's a hmm. Looks like that's an interesting try, but maybe not necessarily a win. You can you can see where it's in there, um, magnetic wise, but. Not necessarily the cutest of things. Uh, notepad. Cute quote, cute pattern. More notepad. Card. Notepad with some more of the lined datedness. Beautiful florals. Our acetate card. Acetate bookmark. That's really cute. I do really want to try a good garden. I've set, I've got a furry thumb, not a green thumb. Um, budget trackers, curious. That could be garden budget trackers. Uh, sticker envelopes, that always comes in handy. And I need to pause it. Stickers that come with the main planner kit. a little one more decoration and two big ones i like the font that they picked this month um yeah that's really cute just again beautiful greens i'm not necessarily a biggest green person but the beautiful beautiful greens um all right so the larger pieces of paper that, that pattern that was on that card or i'm sorry inside the dory Gorgeous. And then nice little leavies. Cute blue pattern there. And then that rimmed with, ooh, very nice, like doodly chevron. Cool. I still miss that we don't get double of that anymore. And then a mini dory. I guess showing off all the different greens that they chose. And just beautiful artwork and colors, as always. But a beautiful theme. Love it. Okay. I did get the bag this time around. So I need to make sure I go update my sub for it. But how could I not look at it? It's so pretty. Um... Yeah, just I loved I loved the coat, I loved the line work, I loved the, the color of it. Um, just beautiful. So I end up grabbing that. And then I get the P6 notebook. Ooh. Which is very much like the mini dory pattern-wise, just larger. So that way I can really use the papers in my journal better. And yeah, love it. Beautiful. And the papers, paper's really nice to write on, all the things. Um, though this should be the add-on, planner add-on. And I'm trying to think, was that one of the ones that they were messing with as well? I think the planner add-on, they're combined are they combining the platter planner add-on and the stationary kit? Something like that. Um so that'll be interesting to see. Um, these are scissors, which I adore. My set that I have. Oh, <laughs> it has a protection tip on it. So take that off and now they open. Um, I have a set just like this. Um, very similar 
set up and, and company. Uh, and they are so useful for on the go. They are great. Um, and they just go in there and so you can take them wherever. So um, that's, that's nice to have an extra set uh, of that. And then we got two washies, another more of the, the colorful floral. Let's look at it. And then a, it's hard to say if that's green, maybe green with gold, kind of a pale, pale green with a gold stripe. That's for our thin washi, which is cute. Um, some little bird paper clips, the mini tabs and die cuts. Pockets, they changed the design on the pockets. Um, they do periodically, but I don't know that we've had this shape of And so that's kind of cool. I do like it, um, the scoop of it. And yeah, really, really pretty, very useful pockets. Cards that come with the main kit is the theme card. Oddly enough, they've got more of the other colors that are like, you know, kind of subtly in there. They've got those a little bit bolder here versus it being all green, which is kind of nice. Um, cute, simple card. Nice quote. And then we've got the day of the week dates with some alphas, more decorations, and some useful stickers that come along with that kit too. Um, this is a single-sided quote card, really pretty pattern. This one's kind of cool because it's all against that shades of, of just the green, pretty. Some more glitter stickers it looks like. These ones are kind of raised, which is interesting. Um, Ooh, I like that much better than the overlay. So I haven't been loving the overlay glitter stickers because it's been um, it's been lifting the stickers up off the sheet. Like they're hard to keep in with everything and not have, you almost lose some of the stickers. This one, it's right, like it's raised. You know, it's only glossy on the, the spot. Um, and so it doesn't touch the cut line. And so you can, you can see everything is really smooth. There's no lifting up points. Um, but it gives it a little bit of shimmer on it. That could really work. I'm very, uh, I'm glad that they're trying different things with that. Cute number stickers. They're like a vellum. Um, more rub-ons. More beautiful floral. This black and white one down here is gorgeous. Then I have two sticker kits. Um, the memory keeping stickers. So I don't know. They didn't say anything about sticker kits changing, so hopefully that means that this won't change. Um, again, I should say, uh, this this is memory keeping. The boxes have stayed the same. Big boxes. There's one little sticker sheet, and then ah, uh, the quotes in vellum are transparent, and then the um, mat. They did start doing this. You've heard me kind of complain about it the last couple times, but um, now we have a box that's just like the card, which I get. If you don't get the cards, you can now have this, but if you get the cards, you now have a sticker that I don't need this sticker. I have the card. Um, so I'd rather it be a pattern paper and I'd rather it not have quotes. So again, whoever's out there, we're getting ready to design your own kit. Constant florals, different colors, same stuff. <laughs> <laughs> don't change things. Uh, I love the little circles. They've got kind of a stamped picture this time. Pretty. More decor. Big green alphas for that kit. And then this is the now called Classic Cousin Kit. And still with the skinnier boxes. I have not used a bunch since they changed it. We do get the patterns, a little bit pretty. Like I like that one where it has just the one hello one. That one's fine. But to really duplicate the stuff on the cards and stuff is just, it's getting a little lazy. Okay. Pretty.
be pretty. This sheet has been a hard sheet for me to pay attention to and use. Like, I'll probably use these ones this time. I might cut off the little rows um, for it, but, uh, and I think I did use these the one time, but I'm trying to find them when I have this and the other one, it is hard. So some of that doubling up. Um, Ooh, pretty yellow alphas. And I use these for my monthly page. And then some of those transparent quotes and stuff. And I don't mind these two being duplicate makes sense because um, it really is a size thing. Um, they do have some different stickers amongst, which is why I get it because it's not just for the size, because um, I like the dates in this, but I liked some of the things here. Um, but some of the duplicates, like I get between those two because you really have that personal preference of what, what kind of notebook you use but um dashboards we get the big ones and the little ones they're all the same patterns um I thought I, I, I didn't realize that they let you um cancel at any time-ish now like I think you're just good for a month um before you had to do three months um, and I may have had to do three months with this, but I guess now, like with the pouch, I, I'm via the group, uh, I can cancel fast on that. Um, but they do have the skip feature too, although you have to skip early enough. You don't really get the preview. It's the whole thing. But anyway, I, I should be canceling this because um, I, I thought I was only doing the three going to do the three month. Um, they're fun. They're nice. This month is very pretty. This would be one of the months that tempts me. Um, but uh Gosh, that one is really pretty. It's just so, I, I just really like this simple. I need it simple in my life right now. Um, other things are too complicated. Um, yeah. Uh, okay, um, so there's those. Um, the bigger versions are exactly the same, just bigger for it. So I can use these as dashboards um, for my rings because they I can trim them to there. I can add these um, in my journal because they're a little smaller and you don't have to trim them. Lots of options. But that is the May unboxing of Coco Daisy. Um, I will get this a little bit organized and ready to play around and use. And then I do need to open up that email and see exactly what has changed and make a game plan on how to adjust from there so thanks for coming along with the unboxing and uh sticking through there with my uh, you know my whatever's going on <laughs> uh thank you again have a good one